and some of you you have remained loyal to him even with the little you have you have been still given even with the little you have you have been sowing seeds even with the little you have you have been trying to be a blessing to someone else Hello there, beautiful people. What's up? It's your girl, Sherry Ann. I'm back. I'm back with another word. I'm here to speak to someone. The Holy Spirit has sent me to speak to someone. Where are my kingdom financiers? Where are my kingdom financiers? God have sent me here to bring a word to you. I know many of you, God have given you promises. God have shown you many dreams, visions of treasures, treasures of riches. And you've been saying, but Lord, what is going on? It seems opposite to what you have told me. It seemed nothing like what you have shared to me. The Lord have sent me here to speak to someone where the devil push you most, where the devil cause frustration the most, is where God is going to bless you tremendously. Many of you are in poverty right now. You don't even know where the next dollar is coming from. You don't even know how you're going to pay your rent next month. God said, sent me here to tell me you're going to be the next kingdom financier. The enemy have been stealing from you. The enemy have been trying to take from you the enemy have been trying to frustrate you so much and you're so frustrated but the lord have sent me here to speak to you child of god the lord said it's only a matter of time hallelujah he will give you the secrets the riches the treasures the treasures the hidden treasures of his riches in secret places the Lord have been allowing the enemy to frustrate you. Yes, the Lord have been allowing the enemy to frustrate you. And this revelation God shared with me where the enemy tempted Job so many times and God allowed it. God um, allowed the enemy to cause frustration, to cause Job to be frustrated, to cause Job to suffer a little. But then when it was time, Job proved his loyalty to God. Satan afflicted him. Satan suffered Job, but nothing changed. Job remained loyal to God. Hallelujah. And some of you, God is saying that you, you have remained loyal to him, even in the little, even with the little you have, you have been still given even with the little you have you have been sowing seeds even with the little you have you have been trying to be a blessing to someone else even with the little you have you have been trying to give into the ministries of God hallelujah and God had to test you in your time um, of need and God says watch me now watch me child of God I'm about to give you the secret treasures um, hidden in secret places hallelujah and so god gave me luke 16 10 and it says whosoever can be trusted with very little can be also trusted with much and whosoever is dishonest with very little will also be dishonest with much hallelujah i'm here to speak to my kingdom financier and i'm here to tell you it doesn't matter how your situation look now God can turn it around in less than a day. God can turn it around in an hour. God can send someone to bless you. God can send an opportunity in a minute. Hallelujah. God can give you a business idea in a minute. Guys, I was in church and I will never forget this. I heard of this lady she was very poor and God all of a sudden came to her in a dream and give her um, the idea of making these um, little cups, plastic cups with um, a little wine and the round um, bread for communion. And she started this business, guys, and she became a multimillionaire. She have came from nothing to something. I know many of you, you have not had um, in your family lineage 
anyone to help you, anyone to financially support you. You had to really try to make something of yourself and it's been hard. The enemy have been stealing from you. You have been seeing it in your dreams. The enemy have been tampering with your finances. But God says to you today, child of God, that he will restore the years unto you. God says he's about to bless you financially in the mighty name of Jesus. I know I've said this many times. You have not been seeing any anything, but God says it's only a matter of time, child of God. Keep holding on to your faith. I remember uh, when I first came into ministry, when I first began to do this YouTube channel, one of the first phrases that I heard God said to me is to think big think big. I'm here to tell someone, keep thinking big. God is going to turn your situation in a matter of minutes. God is going to turn your situation in no time, child of God. So to receive it, I don't know who this word is for, but God has sent me to tell someone that he can turn your situation in no time. Hold on to the promises of God. Do not let go that vision God have given you, that dream God, God have been, um, repetitively speaking to you um, about hold on to it. It is only a matter of time before you see it manifest in your life, child of God. So guys, that is it. I thank you all for tuning in. I love you guys so much. Stay blessed. Stay tuned. And until my next one, bye.